right. Currently at Mount San Jacinto State Park. Hey, welcome back. A little bit of a uh, change of scenery today. I'm currently uh, in uh, Mount Jacinto, Jacinto, however you want to pronounce it. Um, but uh, it is March 21st. And um, look at the snow melting. Um, it's beautiful. Uh, <clears throat> Southern California. Um, where in the world can you play in the snow in the morning and do kayak fishing uh, in the afternoon? So, uh, just beautiful. Look at this. Look at this snow. Now, for most folks in Southern California, this is... Uh, an unusual sight, I guess, because we don't get a lot of snow. Um, and if we do, we gotta go into the mountains. So, uh, we're currently about 8,700 feet above sea level. <clears throat> um, yeah, I don't know if they have snow here all year round, but you can kind of see the snow is kind of melting. Um, like over there, it's all kind of like mud. But um, yeah, we're here just uh, visiting um, Palm Springs for the week, uh, for today. And then uh, tomorrow is gonna be a kayak day. So took a couple of days off work spring break for the kids um, figured uh, let the kids uh, see snow for the first time in their lives so we will see you in the waters all right welcome back <clears throat> another uh, day at Dana Point about 7 a.m. and uh, I don't know we're gonna go for anything that bites today typically that's the plan and uh, try to be safe as soon as I got out here it was windy cold weather forecast is in the high 40s low 50s um, we're gonna try to hit uh, Salt Creek, beyond Salt Creek, towards the north. They're gonna exit out of the harbor here, head towards north about three miles, and then uh, gonna fish around there. But first, I'm gonna try to get some uh, bait, some mackerels, or sardines, you know, sardines, uh, smelts, or whatever. Uh, we'll see how it goes. But, uh, yeah, it's one of those days where I got out here and I'm like, ah, I regret coming out because it was cold and windy. And it's just like, you know, it's one of those days where if you're like, you get out there and you're like, damn, I should have just stayed in bed. But here we are, there's no turning back. Once you're out here, you gotta do it. You know, you're working for free like me sometimes because I have not gotten paid a single penny by YouTube yet uh, which reminds me if you guys uh, like my channel please subscribe or if you guys like the video please subscribe I'll try to up my game every time I make a video something different something uh, unique that nobody, you know, not everybody else is doing. Um, so, uh, yeah, so uh, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, I finally hit that 500 uh, subscriber mark, so uh, 
you know, thanks for putting up with me and uh, <coughs> and, and thanks for uh, subscribing. Oh, I think I'm on. Calico and it released itself. Oh, got him. It is a sand bass. Pretty good size. On the drop shot, Berkeley Gulp. Legal. I don't think you guys can see it, but it's legal. 14. Right on the dot. Right on the dot. Legal size. But he gets to live to see another day. Beautiful looking fish. Healthy. Dorsal fins sticking up. Nice big pectoral fins. Alright, so the line I use is a 20 pound mono. This is a one ounce uh, sinker and um, Berkeley Gulp, like I was saying earlier. Okay. It's pretty, it's pretty simple drop shot. Nothing too fancy, nothing too crazy. So, <clears throat> for those of you that knows tray fishing, that is tray fishing over there. Uh, no, I did not um, communicate with him to meet out here. It just so happens we met out here. So uh, he said he was live streaming. He doesn't do uh, YouTube uploads anymore. So. All right, so I just landed at my personal best gulping.
right, so here um, I honestly was going to release this guy, but um, as soon as I pulled out the hook, uh, he made a whiny noise. Um, and he did swallow the hook, so um, I knew that if I released him back, he was going to die. So I kept it. Look at the size of this thing. Definitely legal. Definitely legal. Okay. GoPro, stop recording. Felt the nibble. Got him. Wow, another sculpin. Big one, too. Man, all these sculpins got like green or blue mouth and they fight hard. Typically sculpins they don't fight. These ones fight hard. They're like cabazons. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. This guy, it's got a blue mouth, blue or green. So, I was showing my friends the uh, pictures of the two fishes I kept, and they told me that these are cabazons and not sculpins. I didn't know cabazons um, exist in Southern California. I thought they're only in the uh, Central Coast and uh, Northern California. But uh, what do I know? I don't know. 
sort of I don't know. Looks like a sardine, maybe? Yeah, what is this? Got a little spot on the back there. I don't know. Yeah. Nice stuff. Yeah, is it? Is it a sardine? No, it's not. Yeah, I don't know. All right, so uh, I was in the water by 7 a.m. and uh, I headed back around 12:30 p.m. Uh, only kept two fishes. So uh, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.